what is up guys Saprox here and welcome back to my channel so this video is not going to be a very usual video it's going to be more like a personal video and in this video I'm basically going to be sharing about what I'm doing right now so as you guys know I graduated on 3rd of May 2024 so what am I doing right now so I'm currently working as a part-time research assistant under a professor at Luddy School of Computing which is under Indiana University and the obvious I'm also trying to look for a job I'm also trying to buy for a job and as you guys know it is not the best of times to look for a job in the US tech market but yeah so what are my future plans my future plan is basically to try and keep looking for a job till the month of December and if I can't then probably look for alternatives but hopeful so my daily routine basically consists of sending out applications, lead coding, changing the resume 100 times a day probably to create those fine-tuned curated applications and doing my RA work. So yeah, that basically what my life looks like right now. But along with that, I also wanted to share a few pieces of advice that I felt if someone had said to me before I came to US would have helped me. And I want to be completely frank, honest and candid about these. So yeah, let's go. So if you're coming to US, be ready for a really dedicated, hardworking and a severe lifestyle. Okay, you cannot ease your way through a master or you cannot ease your way into an internship or a job, whatever. Okay, if you're in US, it's no land for laziness. You cannot be lazy. Okay, you need to be at the top of your game always so yeah be ready for a really consistent and a really dedicated lifestyle and if you can maintain that through your two years through your masters you will make it one of my favorite quote is uh, tomorrow man is a no man and the US is probably the best playground where you can test out that quote and you, basically you have to be a today man here okay you have to be that early bird that catches the worm because that is the only way you will be able to tackle the huge huge amount of competition that you have here be it for on-campus jobs be it for internships full-time jobs whatever it is okay you need to be that early bird you need to be a today man you need to get that thing done so whatever it is you see an application you want to do something you get up you get it done if you keep it for tomorrow you have lost one step so yeah you have to be a today man not a tomorrow man. okay now the next one choose your friend groups wisely okay everyone's here in us to take a shot at this american lifestyle to earn those green bucks but the friends you choose actually reflect the kind of environment you are in the kind of person you will become the kind of stuff you do and choose your friends wisely okay i'm not saying someone's good someone's bad but you have to find those people who tune in to your wavelength who work in your same wavelength so yeah choose your friends really wisely and those friends will become your family members and they can help you that can ease your two years as a master student so choose your friends really really wisely Okay, number four is gonna be embrace your monk mode because US is also a land of distractions. There are possibly a thousand other distractions that can that can distract you from keep keep you from doing that real that you need to get done. So embrace your inner monk mode and just bring out that that superhero arc in you and just keep out every distractions and just keep focusing and keep grinding on whatever you have thought of and whatever you want to do. Number five, I think is the most important one that is be open to a lot of diverse, different perspectives, open perspectives when you come to US and you need to keep a very adaptable mind to these, okay? Because you come to US, US is a land of dreams. You will meet a lot of people, not just from different parts of India, you will meet people from different countries, from different backgrounds, from different ethnicities. And it's like a, a melting pot of different cultures and different kinds of people with different opinions. Everyone has their own viewpoints and everyone wants to make their opinion heard. So you can keep a very adaptable mind. You can keep a mind where you are an observer, you are a listener. You listen. Do not try to impose your thoughts and do not try to impose whatever you are thinking on it. You are wrong. You're right. And do not even try to discount people on their own beliefs. Whatever people believe, they believe it for a reason. So you need to keep a very open mind. You need to keep a very adaptable mind and you need to adapt to your surrounding, to the different fine perspectives you will find here in the US. So yeah, that's all for this video. I really wanted to share these advices because I felt these will help the people who are coming in because it's not always people know what it's like. It's kind of like a bubble always from outside to the people who haven't been here yet. So I just wanted to be really candid and frank and I wanted to share these with you guys. So yeah, that's all for this video. And if you guys liked it, give it a big thumbs up, hit the subscribe like a snare and, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Till then, peace out.